Hang on, why isn't this working? It. That again. What the hell's going on with this? It's not letting me connect to multiplayer for whatever reason. Oh, still no multiplayer. Time and then I should be able to get the right uh, option. Yeah. Oh, it's just regular again. It's starting to annoy me. Reinstall the multiplayer by the looks of things. Ideal, considering we're already midstream. Don't tell me I have to roll back from that update earlier on today. It's it reinstalled. There we go. For some reason it didn't want to play nicely the first time. Not playing nicely. Much. to ramp up the force feedback because I can't feel any of it. And it would help to look for jobs while I was there.
Terrific, the one way there was to find the jobs when they were none is not working. Yeah, I'm online. With me, closing a switch and scene. playing your truck. Apparently the stream isn't actually working. Okay. Hello Nile. How are you doing? Really forgot what I was doing. Shame that you couldn't, uh, still can't get this going. This, uh, this is um, all the Scandinavia bits and just doing them now for the first time. That's what I wanted to do, really quickly. 
was to do cabin adjustments and see if I could get uh, further away from the steering wheel than I currently am. Tablet, it keeps going off on the screen. Throw out a way to make it stay on, and that would be great. And Fucking clutch, unless you press it all the way down, it won't even fucking change the gear for you. Turned off the winter mod, that's the weird thing about this, so I don't know what the hell's going on there. Whoa ho 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 ho! Seems, uh, oh, better. What? Well, I don't know if I asked you this earlier, I think I did, Niall. What do you reckon of the Oculus is going to cost $600, or $600 and apparently even more in Euros? I was really looking forward to actually uh, buying one very soon. Uh, but now, if that's going to be the case, then I'm shit out of luck. I have to get a whole new computer as well for... You're starting to piss me off now. Fucking tablet. <laughs> oh, man. That's this fucking delivery bollocks. That's <laughs> 7%. Vortex, that's bullshit. 
It really is. Now I looked I looked for the uh, DK2 on adverts.ie uh, because I said you know what I've used it before and it seems pretty much on the ball. Some fucking fellow was asking for 650 euro for it. Granted, there's another who was asking for 300, but I mean, it's ridiculous. Hope that uh, whatever Steam and HTC is working on is affordable at least. Where the hell's the nearest uh, service station? Because I'm in big trouble. Next town on the not this side left. Man, I can't believe I fucked up that badly by looking at the tablet though. Oh shit. 21% down. <laughs> It's okay, actually. I mean, I was playing uh, Forza 6 earlier on, trying to get the hang of doing the doing the racing with the gear stick. It is pretty fucking hard. Just the gear stick. That's the hardest part about all of it. But it's easy enough in this. Uh, trouble ahead. Um, but yeah. It's weird because I've never actually used a wheel that has force feedback on Euro Truck before. One does. I didn't realize that even when you're just driving normally, it vibrates like fuck to simulate the engine. One thing I will say about it the clutch is merciless because unless you press the clutch all the way down, it does not change gear. So you do. Yeah, much better than the wheel I used to. What the fuck is this clown doing? Mm -hmm. Oh, these Christmas noobs, what can you do? No entry. Well, fuck me, I've just broken the rules of the road and I don't really care. It'd be nice to find a garage next. Probably be a good idea. That exact reason. Much better than the controller, yeah, definitely. Even if just for the full 900 degrees of rotation you have, because you're so precise with the turning now. I don't think there is a garage here somewhere. Or somehow. God damn it. I'm just starting to play up on my big style.
Oh, that was an expensive crash. Just have to get on with it. Yeah, I'd say that's the thing with the wheel. <laughs> it's probably going to benefit the driver, virtual driver, who knows how to drive in real life, because uh, I don't. Oh yeah, I didn't read that message or I didn't see it, yeah. Not too bad, I mean any wheel is better than any controller. And any controller is better than any keyboard. Well, so many people streaming this game who had just got it and they're like, Oh yeah, keyboard, and they're wondering why they're crashing like fuck. More lights. He's in a fucking hurry. Go first, so am I to say no? Clutch, so fucking annoying. Lady <laughs> Road already. It isn't. These kind of turns here where the wheel really fucking comes into its own because I, I don't think I've made a mistake on these yet. Oh, grinding the, the actual trailer against them or anything like that. I used to do it all the time. song for that. There we go. Timeless. Half one. I woke up at uh, seven this evening. Long night ahead of me in this to kill the time. Well, this thing has a habit of going into the wrong slot quite a lot. They've done like an update or something game. So I'm noticing now on pretty much every single road, if it's like three lane motorway, the speed limit's 80 instead of 90. Yeah, 
uh, mostly get my money out of this because I just bought the uh, bot Scandinavia during the sale or uh, American Truck Simulator comes out. I saw that there, that was a 90 speed sign and now it's 2070, what's going on? Tight bendy roads that really wheel comes into its own. I was thinking now the ideal place to test this out would be on the road to Aberdeen, I think. Scotland. They are some twisty fucking bends. Seems to be struggling to get past the speed, even though it's like full throttle. Wasn't really going uphill, was it? There we go. Your sick thing feels a bit loose. Yeah, Niall, I don't know if you're still there, not, or if you're even listening, but you know how we were talking about the toll roads in this? I was, I was watching someone actually play in this Scandinavia part. They actually have the ones open automatically as you're driving at them at full speed, so... Breaking on this is very hard to do though. Said this is like did job from Poland to Stockholm last night, and then one other a short one. This is pretty much my uh, introduction to Scandinavia. Fucking hell, that's still a long way to go. Just going through Sweden. for once I'll actually go at the speed limit. That move. With better alcohol and driving effect. Well, unfortunately, I don't have... Uh, the alcohol to hand that's safe for human consumption, only Carlsberg, so... <laughs> Shit.
Yeah, about, about, um, alcohol for added enjoyment. Yesterday, when I was, like, when I was starting out playing this, granted it was on 4 to 6, but I was just doing, like, crap for ages and ages, even uh, career mode. Then, <laughs> at 5 in the morning, I had two cups of coffee, planning fully on staying up all day, day, and then setting my sleep routine back to normal. I rarely ever drink any fucking caffeine. Don't even drink tea or any shit like that. And it just seemed to improve all all my skills in Forza because I was winning every race. Oh, listen to those gears grind. One thing I am extremely good at stalling the trucks in this since I got the wheel. Read this thing. Always have emergency vodka. Not only could get emergency alcohol, but that would involve stealing it from David, and I don't think he'd enjoy that all too much. Talk a bit quieter, so I need to have the mic closer to me. Oh, fuck it. Cruise control on, because my leg is getting fucking sore. I was watching, like, some... one of those UK cop shows, you know the ones. <laughs> and they pulled over a truck driver coming into the port at, um... Portsmouth. And he was... Four times over the limit, and he had like cans everywhere in his cabin. And he was actually st oh fuck, there's a guy behind me. He was still driving, <laughs> and he had an open. He had like multiple of the strong cans of uh, can yeah cans of beer, and he had an open bottle of whiskey, and he was about to drive off. Kind of fucking guy. There now, you impatient fucker. You can pass me if you want. This guy is apparently a pirate. Fucking hell, he was going fast. He's a Russian, isn't he? Didn't say. But my money is on it that he is, in fact, Russian. Russian in nationality and rushing to his destination. <laughs> Look 
fucking low gear, but you know what, I'm unwilling to fix it because that would involve having to use the range thing again. Battle's getting away from me again. Cruise controller. It's like shouldn't be driving 11th at that speed by revs and whatnot. Not entirely sure but something to do with fuel. Put in 12th and see how it handles. Summing direct control. <laughs> and of course the fucking gear slips on me. Oh shit. Those are the types of turns I don't like with controllers, but with wheels. Granted, I ha oh, have fucked up on one of them already with the wheel, but you know what? Fuck up with them all the time, so... Fuck it, I'm tired of this Grand Theft Auto music. Mercedes are uh, pretty much exclusively a man driver anyways. You know how much I like to ride men.
be a bit terraria this time instead of but a GTA. near in the city if I'm getting this much lag. I'm good with my gear or my lane changes. I know I need to do them before I even do. Or, or but, uh, let me rephrase: I know to do them before I can see that I need to do them. How many fucking lanes is that? Fuck you, Clutch. Okay, to go. Just remembered I really badly damaged this fucking delivery already. barriers in the middle of the road. What just happened there? Crash again because I have to look at the stream, but someone look at the clock. Oh no, never mind. Too late to tell you that now. Control for a bit more, preserve the leg function. What the fuck was going on here? It's just a tree. The tree. Oops. Christ again. Fuckers, they're about as fond of their round, uh, roundabouts as we are.
for the real entertaining bit, because I have been pretty shit at parking ever since I stopped. Or ever since I started using this, having not used the wheel in so long beforehand. Damn, that's an actual supermarket. Ugh, this could be challenging. And I'm in the wrong lane. That's not too bad. Gonna be brutal. Close enough. <laughs> yes. Reasonable. Man, I lost a lot of XP for that. Take a uh, take a job somewhere more populated. Ooh. Sucker for punishment. Hell. to figure out which one <laughs> right there hey racer Uh, 
lines like hell. It's a second now to like drive in a straight line, then I can read the chat messages. Uh, hello, Brown's Legit Gaming. Heading to a Yank on TeamSpeak. Want some company? Downside is you would hear your own voice. If you continue to watch the street, uh, stream with the volume. Here I've gone the wrong way into here. Oh yeah, definitely. There's no one else oh here. See this terrible display. He was not a but oh. All I want to know is where this fucking job marker is there it is. seat out of an old car and just use that instead. Not stuck with this rotten office chair. So now, start crying and throws corn at you.
User entered your channel. Be make a new channel for you. Okay. Channel were created. User joined your channel. Oh, it'd be lovely if I could spell. <laughs> oh. oh no, it was it was quite funny. Channel edited. He got like really pissed and then left, so I left. You're a bold one.
They, they, I don't know what, even know what they were discussing, some boring shit. Okay, I have to move or I'll be kicked. Oh. Okay, I made it. You have to drive, is it? Yeah. But, um, yeah, yeah. They were gonna really boring stuff, and then I, I called him a corn husker. <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, "Oh, you just don't know the like the quality of women you're missing out." And then I just said, "I thought I'm gonna fuck the men or the cows. Which one would you prefer?" Because I hear the women aren't good there. And he was a little bitchy. That's what you look for in your ideal women. <laughs> that they have gen. <laughs> no, that they have female genitalia. Not something <laughs> he'd know about with the Nebraskian. <laughs> you lost your viewers, James. What happened? I know. Uh, two of them were us. One of them was that other guy. I played this with before. <laughs> He's from Ireland as well. Brown. No, ra rashes and beans. And, uh. I think there's like one. not logged in person watching. No, Brown's the jit gaming. Oh, yeah. He said hi. What the fuck is going on? My trailer's. <laughs> stuck for. You're not moving. <laughs> Whoa, is that stream as choppy for you as it is. Yeah. Uh, on my. T Oh fuck, right. Oh wait, no, hang on. No. That's okay now. Yeah, I was stuck on something that whole time. <laughs> Couldn't figure out what. But remember, I'm like, what, 26 and a half seconds behind? No, it's actually really quite uh, close to, to the time I'm on. If you right click on the video player and, like, uh, I think it's like stats for nerds or stats or something, it'll tell you time to broadcaster. Show video stats. Yeah. Fifteen seconds latency. It's not all too bad. Your the playback rate for me isn't that bad either. What are you like, receiving it up? Uh, source. Ah, uh, yeah, but that's because I've got like it way down. It's eight hundred kilobits per second. I'm receiving 888. Up and down, of course. Nat and 750. It's gonna be near enough uh, to eight 800. Figured out that's the magical number around here for streaming. Why did you say that? It always seems to work when I'm only at 800 kilobits a second and the Xbox seems to default to that uh, number as well hmm. where's Nigel I am unaware don't chase him up for me <laughs> I need them viewers Yeah, I bought the the Mercedes truck. Not you, good. Yeah. I, ever since I've figured out that this truck had like the the green thing in the rev meter, showing you when to shift gears or when you're when you're good and when you're not good, and the other trucks don't have it. That's when I realised that yeah, I'm pretty much a man driver now. <laughs> and you like all the puns that go along with it. Naturally. But who wouldn't? That, that isn't that one of the main reasons for a man. I can't listen to your sound because it's horrible listening to myself coming back on. Yeah, mute, <laughs> mute the stream if you haven't done it already. I did. If you want the music, you can just go to Spotify and listen to the Terraria soundtrack. Oh, playlist. Yeah. They have three full albums of the Terraria songs. I, I was actually playing Terraria today, but, and by playing, I mean I left it on to listen to the music. <laughs> there you go. I think the artist for them is uh, Re-Logic. 
search that, you'll be grand. Yeah, it's just as easy just to run to your area, though. What's the Scandinavia like? Uh, plenty more roundabouts than Europe right. at large. Um, uh, it's annoying. I haven't met a toll gate yet. Uh, in the cities, they st they have the actual motorways in the cities instead of just like, oh, you're in a city now. All the roads are simple. There's the ring roads and everything. Not extremely far oh, out. That's good. Yeah, roundabouts are pretty much the big feature. An American truck is coming out soon, isn't it? That's second of February. Second or third, either or. Is one of the reasons I'm glad I have the wheel now and I'm getting the practice in, so I won't fuck up as much. But there should just be longer, large stretches. There. There's no fucking roundabout. Yeah. That's the thing is. Fucking hell, this is either a big hill or my engine is suffering. Yeah. Um. It's the state of California. Pretty much. Is that all they've got? Yeah, but it's to large scale. So it's, it's the same scale as most of Europe in this. Huh. And I assume DLC state. Yeah, that's what they said they're gonna do. At any rate. I want to do Texas, goddammit. I want to drive across Texas and shoot a gun out the window of me moving vehicle. <laughs> Need a fucking 28 ounce steak or whatever the fuck, I don't know, steaks. Murder well, a couple driving. of prostitutes, yeah. <laughs> well, getting a BJ from a prostitute. Having some flag burning out your window. I'm not sure which flag, <laughs> but some enemy state. Some all flags out the window on a big string. Anti-Americans. Yeah, burn the North Korean flag while you drive <laughs> along. <laughs> no, burn like like the South African flag because you think it's the uh, <laughs> North Korean. <laughs> Those damn North Koreans. <laughs> Then like the Irish flag, which means the Indian flag, yeah? Yeah, that's, that's what you need to do. You're a proud American, so that means you uh, cling on to as much imaginary heritage as you can. <laughs> oh, I'm 164th Irish, so you know, pract I'm practically IRA at this <laughs> at this rate. <laughs> yeah, I've got... Be like, yeah, make a bomb for me there and light it on fire. Yeah, I've got jo uh, German, Polish, French, and uh, this fucker's not gonna stop. Oh, he is. What fella, the one that's coming up on the right? Yeah, I thought he wasn't gonna fucking stop when he was going at full speed coming up to the junction and I'm like, shit, <laughs> take it, start taking evasive maneuvers and then he just stops. <laughs> I didn't think he was gonna stop there though, I thought he was speeding up again. <laughs> Do they find you now on this for walloping other people? Multiplayer? Yeah. Fuck no, this is the uh, this is EU2, the one without any speed limits, so this is the wild west of uh, Western European servers. <laughs> it, it'd be cool if they had managed to, like, that they had to pay the offset of the damage of the trailer. Ah, uh, they never got that, that kind means... of system in implemented. I know that would have been good, though, because that means you, you wouldn't actually lose any money for someone ramming into you. Yeah. Is that your steam or mine that's beeping? Yours. Oh, Nigel no, said he's coming on now. Excellent news. Is that a compass on the dashboard? It is. I have a few other things that I'm looking at now. I have a bulldog bobblehead thing, mug, and aviator sunglasses, and an icebox and a bag full of my clothes, apparently. Sat nav attached to the window and fuzzy dice. A, ba a bag full of dead hookers, eh? Hey? Oh shit. Oh. Well, that was a bad idea, James. No, it's it's just <laughs> I was trying to put the view back to normal and I accidentally hit F5 instead of 1. For whatever reason, so my sat nav zoomed out. F5 1 the same thing, right? Oh yeah. What 
what's the fuel consumption like on your man? Fucking hell, it's bad actually, because I, I, <laughs> during that first delivery, when I crashed, I also started to get the fuel in the light, though I had to go and get fuel as well, but uh, apparently um, I'm not full again, so I have to pull in the next fuel station. I have realistic consumption turned yeah. off. I found that the first aid is really good consumption. Huh? That's the only thing that's good about it, is fuck all power. Which, the Mercedes? Is, yeah, but it's really good fuel consumption. It's not even power, because it can go fast. It's, it's acceleration is diabolical. Is that with the default engine, or did you put a better one in? Oh, default, I can't. I haven't unlocked the... You know, the next level up, or whatever it is. So I only just got my first own vehicle, you know. To pay back the old bank, you know. I took out a huge fucking loan yesterday, and that reminds me I need to pay off my smaller one, so I'm just pulling in. Yeah, I took out a huge loan uh, in order to buy a garage in Poland, so I could do the back and forth between the garages to get free money thing. Uh, yeah. The conversation is funny out of context. <laughs> Goose, you heard nothing. Oh, I, f uh, I, f I forgot to tell, um, I go on first. I've forgotten what I'm saying. Go. Garages, between the two. Oh yeah, I finished what I was saying there. You want to say something, man? Oh yeah, um, because yeah, I'll be back in Ireland. On Tuesday. Because, mm. um... She's a girl from like Valentaba. She's nice enough, quiet. Um, mm. She had a brain aneurysm and died. All right. All right. And her brother died of the exact same thing. Mm. I know my granddad died of a brain aneurysm. Then, yeah, but it's really suspicious. Two people of the exact. They were nearly the exact same age. So there must be a massive. What? Are you saying they died like like both of them died recently? Like no, no. One died. You know, but they're actually literally the exact same age. You know what I mean? Yeah. It must be a weakness of some description. Oh. Like a genetic. I shall come and watch the stream to boost my numbers. Uh, I, I, to be honest, I'll probably go to sleep soon. I, I have an exam tomorrow. <laughs> Alright. I thought you weren't even going. I, I, me dad was on to me. He said I should probably go on and give it a go. Ah, uh, go on. Nothing to lose. Uh, well, that's fine. There's people I don't Pride. want to meet. There's people I don't want to meet. Yeah, right, there's people there I don't want to meet. Either. And don't meet them. Don't just, meet them, just fucking do the exam and say, fuck you, you everyone. You just, run in, you just run in, do the exam and run out and... Walk in, fuck you. go in in disguise. <laughs> uh, I feel like a sombrero and you some mask. Sunglasses, I wore sunglasses. Yes. They let me take off my smart watch. Do you know where that is though? Because of mirrored sunglasses. What if Kevin went in with his fancy pants sunglasses? They couldn't force him to take them off. They could. Mm. The light shouldn't be sufficient enough in that room to activate the sunglasses. Mm. What if I said I was involved in a welding accident and that I need to wear sunglasses at all? And they were like, well, you should be fucking blind. And then they'd ask you to give medical proof of your welding accident. Start scaring you with blow torches, and when you didn't react, they'd know something's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> in fairness, it sounds like even a blow torch in your face, if you don't get scared, probably something fucking wrong with you. Mm. I'm gonna pull in for fuel here. Because I, do, I know somebody who has an exam tomorrow, I don't want to see them at all. So at the same time that I have my exam. Don't, don't worry, to... Melissa's not going to that exam. <laughs> you're, you're safe <laughs> enough. <laughs> It, 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 did Melissa? I thought Melissa passed everything. Uh, she didn't pass her, or she didn't e either didn't do or didn't pass. And I think you're the one who didn't do her thesis. But she passed one for the exam. I think so. That's it's very rare that you fail your thesis. They never fail you on your thesis unless you didn't actually put or submit anything. Yeah, mine didn't even fail. Mine didn't. Like, no. If Nigel had submitted something, he probably would have scraped a pass. McDarrow in fairness. Wouldn't let me, he wouldn't, McDarrow wouldn't let me submit. I mean, if you sneaked it past him, 
and submit I it. I specifically said, can I submit this? And he said, no, you can't. I think he was saying, no, you can't. <laughs> but <laughs> well, it was well, just... No, that's what I to him. That's what I to him. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you probably, like, I'm not really funny, if you do submit something, they usually just pass, like... I'm sorry I asked him at all. Yeah, you should have just submitted it. Yeah, 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 and you would have passed it. Mm -hmm. But with the fact that I emailed him and said, can I submit what I have? And he's like, no, you can't, because I don't want to accept it. Yeah, if you just submitted it, he couldn't have just said anything, and then you would have passed. Maybe. No, because they generally don't fail you in your pieces unless you write nothing. Uh, Mark Vaughn failed his thesis. Yeah, but he's a fucking stoner. Like, he failed because he's so, he went into it and he, the, the way he was dressed, he, he, uh, he didn't dress properly. Oh, like you him. told me he dressed like a like, muppet, didn't he? He wore like a hoodie and a trackies, like, into, into his... Into Viva, his or Viva, whatever it is, yeah. He can't, he can't go into it like that. No. That was a dangerous overtake, Nikki. You're a dangerous woman. You'll see it on the stream now in a, a couple man. of seconds. No, Nikki. Yeah, but there isn't a, a Nikolov is a Russian name. What, what Nik Nicholas? A yeah, Nikolai. Well, well, A, it would be written in Cyrillic if it was a Russian name, and B, come on, Nikki, N-I-K-K-I. What about Nikki? Oh, oh, do you know what? <laughs> <laughs> Might have it another... Could be a trans it could be a transgender German coming out on Eurotrack. Stranger things have happened. Fuck, that's a roundabout. In the middle of a fucking dual carriage. Well, okay, it's a single carriageway, but I was going full speed and it was dangerous. I thought you said dual carriageway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't slow down for one of them. Don't you know I'm delivering some kind of uh, oven parts to uh, Auschwitz? <laughs> a factory in Eastern Poland, yeah. <laughs> You basically drove across that roundabout, Joe. <laughs> yeah, James, it was like, this roundabout doesn't exist. <laughs> exactly. Remember, Joe used to do that. Oh, God, no, they were ramps to take off into fucking space with Joe. Yeah. Now, here, you can guess. How much money do you think Adler are going to pay me? Uh, minimum wage. Yeah, you, th you think so, yeah? Yeah. That would be the smart option with you, anyways. They're not they going to pay you any more, break, Nigel. Yeah. Huh? They're not going to give you any more. You'll get shift allowance though, of course. The fucking okay. sat-nav just told me to cut through a petrol station. <laughs> thank, thank fuck I have common sense and didn't. You cut through the petrol station, James. No. It was. Um, but no, um, yeah, what it's minimum shift wage. Allowance, like, how much is that? It depends. Like, if it's night shift, it's more. Hmm. It's, ti it's usually time and a third. That's a bit gay. And then night is usually the time and a half. Enough. Yeah. They can get folks to pay minimum wage. I'll be gone as soon as the contract is over. Steal all yeah, the that's, Botox that's first. That's what they're doing. Look at mm. Kevin was on minimum wage for how long? Mm. It's the shift allowance that generally makes it worthwhile. Entry level microbiology jobs pay more than entry level quality control jobs. I thought you yeah, said internet yeah. and microbiology jobs, and I was like, what the yeah. fuck kind of jobs are they? <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to know, guys, an internet microbiology job. Yeah, but, um, no, um, that's, me uncle would tell me that. <laughs> I am well. The problem is, the future for microbiology is a bit. I don't care about future. I don't attend to Yeah, but you know what I mean? It's. That's not my problem. <laughs> Fucking snow. I specifically. Turned off the uh, winter no. mod. No shit, you've left the city. <laughs> Fucking on a boat. Rain rain. Yes, it's taking a massive like hit. You can't handle the rain. What the fuck? You just can't handle getting wet. I'm wondering what the fuck did I bind down on the D-pad because it it just tried to stop my truck. <laughs> Engine stop, yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if I made a stupid fucking mistake like that. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, it's engaged trailer. Oh, there you go. First, first you must stop your truck. Mm. It's to disengage the trailer. You look like go full speed and launch it off the back. That's bullshit. <laughs> I'm That's gonna complain to the developers. The multiplayer, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just, <laughs> oh, just going around the roundabout and launching off some other exit while you fucking just turn the other one. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, James, I shall tell Niall about the dream I had about you. Yeah. Oh god, I don't wanna know! Was it like a Mr. Burns and Smithers dream? <laughs> It was more no no no. You are quite good yeah, at no, no, turning no. me on. <laughs> <laughs> no, just like if I take funny. these injections every five minutes, I'm not gay. <laughs> uh oh, it looks like a fake. It was my oh, name that James met. James uh, Mead. No, I, uh, I said Mead. James Mead again for Android and Windows, but not not iOS. Not iOS for whatever reason. It was uh, just for Android and Windows. Do you want a funny why story? That's actually. IOS? Why do you hate iOS? Because you have to pay uh, 100 euro for the developer license, and you can only actually develop for uh, develop the games on a Mac. Oh, well, that makes sense. Then. That's pretty much a, th a thousand euro to make iPhone games. No fucking thanks. Well, the dream, the dream version of you had no problem making Android games. Right? <laughs> you know, you, you say that now, but it's funny because if I were to release a game tomorrow, it would be Android and Windows. Yes. But I do have. I, I, the <laughs> I do. Like you're having wet dreams about your programming. That's fucking weird, Joe. No, no, they're not wet. Uh, they're solid. <laughs> Tell them. It, it was. It involved trees. Uh, it was um, a sled so a sled game. It was like a sledding game. Like a what, is that what you call them? Like snow. Like, yeah. If I was a psychologist, like so you've got. Dreams about games making stuff. Uh, you huh? games based on wood and oh, releasing you know white and, and, and releasing good. white solid matter. Now, Nigel, everything with a homosexual say, complex. This is all now. But he, he was making he was making a game. It was basically just like dodging trees. It was like an old like NES game or something. Like, ah, yes. Do you know what game you are thinking of? It's a game called Ski Free for Windows 98. Maybe. I, I was thinking more. Do you know the um, the original from Russia? Was it from Russia with Love or Die Another Day, where you're going down the mountain on a fucking jet, not a snowmobile, and you have to avoid? Yeah, oh, that's it, skis. And you have to avoid yeah. all the trees. Ski yeah, do they call them? Oh wait, no, no, you're thinking of skis. Yeah. It was basically that, but with a sled instead of skis. Right, well, you, what you need to do right now is go to YouTube and look up Ski Free and tell me if it is if it isn't that game, but with uh, a sled instead. That uh, sounds very familiar, Ski Free. I think I remember playing that. In primary school computer. is when I played that. Whose fans go? Nigel, your fan is fucking crazy loud. And Nigel... No, it had better graphics. It, it, it had better graphics. But the concept I'm on about. Uh, yeah, sort of, but it, it was the camera was behind you. So it's like a downward facing. The, the, basically, like the free. James Bond game, then, because that was no, a downward. Ski, ski Free is kind of going down, whereas James's imaginary dream based game uh, was going forward. The camera was going forward, the camera was behind you. Yeah, like you were looking, you were on the sled. It's first person, basically. You, well, no, you could see the you could see the sled and the person sitting on the sled, but you like your camera was like behind their back. All right. It's like a quasi third. Uh, I don't know. This is like a curve sled game. Just... Yeah, that is a game like idea what? I had before. Yeah. As I told you already. Well, you, maybe you told me that at some point. I don't think so. <laughs> Mm. You told me that, games. I remember you telling me that. Mm. Well, maybe I'm a, a, more of a big mouth than I thought. Mm. I wonder I just randomly dreamed about it. Yes, Nigel. What other weird off. dreams are you having? Uh, what else? Do you I take any magic I'm... tablets before you go to bed, subscribed by the doctor? I've been smoking a lot of heroin. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that, 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 there's the explanation there. Yes, yeah, so the hall, the hall and notes effect. That's why, uh, that's why you're thinking that I, ke I keep subliminally telling you, you make my dreams come true. <laughs> you <laughs> make my dreams. <laughs> oh, yes, and I've also been, uh, what is it, injecting a lot of weed. Yeah. Oh no, that's dangerous. Solid, yeah, like that's for blockages. <laughs> no, John McCary told me to feed opposite. I thought he was like completely right. I was like, I said, if you inject the weed, you probably die. And he's like, yeah. no, you wouldn't. 
It's a solid. Like, that's what I said. That's what I said. And he's like, you wouldn't draw your draw. That's ridiculous. And I said, it would. <laughs> unless you're <laughs> unless you're Jesus. injecting it into your mouth or something like that and chewing it. <laughs> yeah, with a syringe. Was, it was really funny because he was like full sure it wouldn't kill you. Like, no, it definitely would not. No, yeah, it definitely would. It's a plant. Yeah. For one thing. I don't know, man. Plant stemmels and all that fucking, you know. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah, but this is not like a fucking lizard. They'd be like taking a sting in there and going, just inject that into it. It's good for ya. Okay, to be quite nice. I just remember something. Uh, James, my brother in Leaving Cert, he wants to do computer software development in GMIT. Uh, I suppose no harm in that. Hmm. I don't know. He was going on about it this evening. He's really crap at maths. Aren't we all? You don't, you only really need maths if you're gonna do games because you're. Granted, you're not actually doing the calculations yourself, but you have to know which calculations are going to be done and how to set them up to be done. But other than that, yeah, maths is piss. What? The computer does all the actual maths. So you just need to know the formula and yeah. the method. Yeah. I don't know. He was just on about it this evening. I think he only wants to do it just because he wants to go to Gaul. Oh, and well, be with your other brother. Oh, it no, wouldn't be a bad idea. Him. He just wants to go to Gaul with the crack. Yeah, Gaul is not too mad for the crack. Yeah. As well as the heroin. Yeah. I was... Damn it, Nihil, I was about to make it a <laughs> shitty joke similar to that one. I know, yeah. I knew <laughs> what you were going to do. I preemptively struck. You could just hear the gears grinding and not the ones from the truck. <laughs> <laughs> the ones in my brain. <laughs> We were, we were up to six viewers there, but gone back down to three. Here you put them off somehow. I was talking about heroin in the yeah. Probably yeah. the best uh... Welcome to the ghetto. Yeah. <laughs> the ghettos of where the fuck are you? This truck is loaded to the fucking brim with heroin, Wait. that's what I'm delivering. Do you know what's funny as well? I looked up the micro department in uh, Aragon, right? Yeah. And I looked up on uh, what's called LinkedIn, and like basically everyone working there has like a master's yeah. uh, in microbiology. I'm the only, I'm like the only person there with like a degree. If you'll be like the run around butt boy. I don't care as long as you get money. Two sugars there, Nigel. That's thanks. What you'll be doing. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I don't really care as long as they give me money. Mm. I don't, I don't intend to stay there longer than a year. Until you get caught in a trap, but you can't walk out. Actually, that's bullshit, you can always eat. Because you love it too much, baby. How did you not see that coming a million miles away, Nigel? You took that's the bait. You to work contract. <laughs> you can always contract. Ah, you took the bait really hard there. <laughs> oh no, that doesn't excuse you, Nigel. No, that was just shit. That. Yeah, if you sign that, you're nothing but a hound dog. Ooh, um. <laughs> but, uh, no, uh, Kevin seems to be under the pressure that you can't leave when you sign a contract. You can? can. That's only rubbish. She can leave whenever you want. You have yeah. to just give notice. Yeah, uh, there's just a minimum notice period. Yeah. It doesn't matter if you sign a fucking 24 month contract or a 2 month right. contract. Yeah, as long as you give them, it's usually a month's notice. What is it? It's two weeks. Some of them are a month, if it nope. states it in it. Mm, no, they can't do that. I know that I've seen a contract that says you had to give a month. Bullshit. But it, I'm sure it was a month. Mm -hmm. No, bullshit. Could have been no. two and a half weeks. No, no shit. Sure. What, what they can do is, is they can put a clause in it that you have to pay them. Yeah, yeah to buy out of your contract. Clause? They ho, 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 motherfucker. They, they can <laughs> do that already. We own you. They wouldn't really do that to an entry level job. That's more like. No, because yeah, it's like if you're the top guy in it. Yeah. Because then it's like a kind of a big deal if you leave, because then like, things get a bit fucked. Uh oh, Nikki is but, back. But then the thing with that though, Nigel, the mm. company it's taking you is probably willing to pay that fee. Yeah. So. In, it? in general, yeah. you can pretty much always leave a contract. Yeah, yeah. Like I when I told them to fuck off yesterday. Mm. <laughs> well, I suppose that's a bit different. I don't have to give any notice because it's agency. Yeah. No, because they're basically like, because you know, I'm saying I'm going to come home for a while, because I haven't yeah. like seen my mother and all that, so I better come home. Mm -hmm. And I was like to them, you know, I've got all this holiday, and I want to take it, and they're like, oh, you can't. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I said, I fucking can. Yeah. And they're like, oh no, you can't. 
Mm. And I was like, I can, I just have to give you the notice if I want to. Yeah. And they're like, oh no, it's very inconvenient for us. And I said, don't give a shit if it's inconvenient for you. Yeah. And it's like, do not listen to me, you'll have to give nearly two months notice to take a day. Boy. Or a week. And I was like, well, I says, well, I, I'm quitting. And they're like, what? And I was like, yeah, <laughs> I'm quitting. I didn't have to give any notice for that because it's agency. Yeah. And they're like, oh, but we need you to work tomorrow. And I went, I don't give a shit. Find someone yeah. else. Oh, yeah. bollocks. I have to restart the game. I got disconnected. Ah. But I was like, yeah, I don't give a shit. Find yeah. someone else if you're going to treat me like this. Mm. And do you know what? They rang me up today and went, oh, yeah, we're really sorry. You can take your holiday. We'll have you back. And I went, not really. Not after that. <laughs> yeah. Because I've also been offered another job from a different temp agency. <laughs> Where is it? It's over. It's oh, all money. over for them. Ha ha ha. Um, scientific Mathematics. For who? Uh, I've got the name of the company here. Two seconds, Nigel. Why would you want to uh, do fucking Scientific Mathematics? That seems like money's the good. of what you'd want to do. Money's good. Sure, shite, uh, man. Yeah, but I looked at the stuff. It's all done on a computer. It's just data entry, mostly. Mm. Which is piss. So I'm just getting the, um, in, using Twitch when minimize there for a second. Mm. Um, Interroll. Is mm. that what they're called? Go on. Let me just Google it. Oh, no, don't tell me it's doing this shit again. I'm only feeling that I'm not on multiplayer now. Yeah, um... Interroll. I've never heard of them before, but... I've never heard of them. They're a subsidiary of someone else. Mm. I should say my knowledge on science companies isn't particularly yeah. great anyway, so... Yeah, I'm not online. Bollocks to it. Do you know what they do? They seem to, like, um... Outsource, if you know what I mean? Like, data mm. processing? An entry from like mm. other science companies. Mm. It's I looked it up. It's such handy work, Nigel. Mm. It's not like you even have to do maths. It's basically like you know, like an Excel. All right. Put X into boxes. Click it's enter. Like accounting to me. Yeah, mm. I know, but it's scientific data entry. You know. Mm. You can like even have. Technician. Yes, you can even have a degree in IT yeah. for like, because if you have a degree in IT, they put you on the, the database design stuff, or in science, like be able to look through the data. It's basically see like if they've made a horrendous mistake, you know what I mean, while you're input the data. <laughs> Which oh. they're not going to want you to see anyway, so you may as well not point it out. It's the third time I've had to reinstall the multiplayer today. Ah, Just to get back on. Yeah. So, you know, it's not... Not too bad, Nigel. Oh. So you, you having this micro job would be kind of shy. Yeah. It's not going to be brilliant, Nigel. I don't want it to be brilliant. But do you think it'll be like really shit? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. you know, all all those entry levels are though, Nigel. I didn't mind what I was doing in Charles River that much. I, I only just didn't like the fact that I wasn't getting paid. Didn't you say that it's a real? It could be handy though, because it's you said it was a real like laxy daisy there. That's the impression that they give. But I mean, I only met the head of I met the head of the department, and I met the head of you know uh, what you call it, HR. But like, yeah. it's totally different from the actual day to day running the place. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The ground. Like your man told me, the head of the micro department told me that it's pretty hectic, he said, especially compared to other departments. And I was kind of going, "Fuck! I should." In my head, I was like, "Fuck! I should have just applied to a uh, chemistry job instead." Yeah, because mi the problem with micro is they're usually horrendously understaffed, as you've yeah. noticed. Micro oh, management oh, department. Uh, Listen, listen to he said that microbiology is just 9 to 5 Monday to Friday at the moment, whereas chemistry is all shift work. Shift work's better though for monies, if you don't I'm care about... 
Uh, in certain ways, but he said micro will be changing to shift work soon enough. So. Because shift's actually handier three days a week instead of five. Mm. I mean, yeah, yeah. Mm. Right, I think it might be that the actual server itself has gone offline. <laughs> I can't imagine I'd be doing much if the person wants to design it for his training. It depends. Mm. You could be training for two, three months. Mm. Micro training is pretty handy though, isn't it? I don't know. Don't know. Not too much time. Uh, actually, I remember the, actually, no, the girl when I, in Charles River, the, one of the masters, she said they wouldn't let her do any LAL testing for like three months. Yeah, you have to go, like, assess. She said she had to keep watching, and then, like, she had to watch them for, like, a month, she said. She basically did nothing but watch. Then, like, the second month, she had to, like, do it without that someone else was watching her do everything. And then the third month, then she was allowed to do it on Super Bowl. Yes, yeah, I suppose that's a key component to the testing of the drug release, Nigel. Yeah. yeah. I like, urge you to fuck that up. Because mm. if you hadn't been properly trained, that would be your first thing you say. Yeah. And then the then you, uh, thing would be lit. The mantle would be lifted off you. Mm. If you could prove, oh, like I, I just did what I was. I didn't know I wasn't going to do that. You know. Yeah. And they're literally on shit's creek without a paddle. No, no micro tests are particularly difficult. Though. No. They are important, no. Yeah, but it's, yeah. none of them are, they're all pretty like, just, you know, do this, then do that. Like, they're all, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, it's like step A, B, then C. It's pretty hard mess I think, often, actually. Mm. I don't know. Either I like, have sleep or something. Yeah. yeah. You'd be surprised if people can fuck up. Hmm. Suppose if you're tired. Of course there's a status page right there and I uh, didn't click on it. And of course EU2 is offline. Brilliant. So I have to... Go different server. Quit all the way out of this one again. Fucking don't like EU1, full of rules. <laughs> yeah, you want to be a rebel on the road. You'd better fucking believe I do. You're a rebel without a cause, isn't that the... Well, I do have a cause. I have to deliver these goods. <laughs> yeah. Are these goods of perishable nature? Much like the truck drivers that I crash into at high speed. <laughs> ah. I have to reinstall the multiplayer again. This is Come beyond on. fucking ridiculous because if I quit out, that's it has to be reinstalled. What do you mean reinstalled? Like, download the file? No, oh, I have the file downloaded, but I have to run the installer again. That sucks. Yep. That's a really bad design. Make it better, James, with your programming skills. Couldn't if I wanted to. They're all Polish. You couldn't if you tried, is all you're trying to say. James? Yes, yes, yes. Are you setting it up for another 80s classic? Ugh, no. Works. Why not? There's nothing wrong with 80s classics. That's what Nigel's considered to the young women these days. The multiplayer's working. Isn't that right, Nigel? I didn't hear you what because that's what you're considered these days, the young women. You're a vintage model now. I don't talk to the young people anymore, they're only much fun. So. <laughs> it took you that long to figure it out? No. What other game has good music that I can listen to on Spotify? Undertale? Say? Undertale. Oh. I'm not that keen on that game. No, it's shite, but it's good music. 
Yeah, no, I, I don't mind the actual soundtrack, it's quite nice. On about a game I've actually played. But, like, oh, right. Under Undertale is horrendously over dramatized Oh, it's the best game ever and all this shit. Mm. It's not good. But that's no, crap. Uh, but, uh, the, the music is cool. Um, yeah, but they've got, like, the previews ever on the interwebs. Of course, it's a hipster game. Game journalists are massive hipsters. Yeah. Game journalists are cunts. Hmm. Did Jeff like it? Seems like he'd like it. He didn't love it, but he liked it. Is this Jeff Keighley? My oh. giant bomb, Jeff Gerstmann. Who has all the girth? Well, they give Game of the Year to Mario Maker. Okay. A giant bomb? Yep. I feel just ashamed for them. And they give Turns Mr. Solid, like, num number two. Turns out the giant bomb went off in their fucking brains and led to permanent damage. Mm. It must have been. A Compario Maker is cool and everything, but like, it's just a level It's maker. not that cool. You know, whatever, like, it, it's just a level of the creator. You know? Yeah, it's basically what they probably should have added to the last god knows how many Mario games. They yeah. developed it with an older Mario game and just went, we can fucking release this and idiots will buy it. That's very much obviously what they've done. Huh? <laughs> next oh, year's God. next year's game of the year, Skyrim Creation Kit. <laughs> Zelda Zelda Maker. <laughs> Zelda Maker, yeah. Sonic the Hedgehog um, Maker. <laughs> no, what's what's people's like hard on Metroid Prime? Green Shield Metroid. Zone. Metroid, Metroid Prime is pretty cool now. So yeah, but a, a Metroid like level creator. Metroidvania, whatever the fuck that is. It's your people. It's, it's a hybrid of Castlevania and Metroid. They already hate it. Those were two pretty cla classics there, Catalonia and Metroid. Yeah, I watched someone play one of those recently on S that S is it SDQ? Which Me Metroid? Metroid? Yeah. The Fusion, I'd say, was it? I don't know what one it was, I, I just or caught Super the end Met of it. Super Metroid. Was it two pilots playing at one controller, or was it just one person? One person. That was Fusion. Seemed pretty cool. It is, the GBA game. Damn you, damn you and your stupid abbreviations. EBA, the important man. I know. There was a very funny, um... <laughs> James, comment. James, does it, uh -oh. does it get a midget, does a midget person to pull out uh, uh, an HD, HD2 at the moment? <laughs> oh god. Ah, uh, now, Nigel, you're prejudiced against midget. It's really, it's funny. What did you say? I couldn't hear because of the music. There is a, a little person uh, speaking on uh, games done quick, you know, ADQ at the moment. <laughs> Everyone in the chat is making fun of us. <laughs> Including oh, you, I bet, I bet you were the first one to fire a fucking no, Kappa no, in that situation. Matt and I was the Nazi. They're all calling them, them Tyrion Lannister. You're like that small fella from Game of Thrones. I, Twitch chat is cancer. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. Oh, it's I know, like, the black person on screen, now everyone just oh, grabbing black Oh, like that happened earlier on, they were playing in Sonic, and they were like, Yo, homie. What happened, my nigger? Um, <laughs> oh no, the funny thing is we're doing a ghetto jump in Metroid Prime and then everyone slammed the chat in the back of it. It's like, fuck this, jump, <laughs> ghetto jump in the hood. <laughs> like, oh, it was like, what's it else they were doing? Uh, your black group, you're playing Sonic. Mm -hmm. And it was like, this man has lots of, um, lots of practice going fast away from the police. My, the funniest one is when you say uh, Kappa Pride, but nobody wants to notice, and then occasionally you get to people go like, I know this, it's a gang of <laughs> Just to be safe. Oh. Just quick saved and I'll do it again. There was a bloke on that who started his, his run with, I'm not gay. Mm -hmm. But... And then uh, it didn't go very well for him after that. Mm. There was one main thing that, that was the uh, the chat for the whole of his fucking run. Mm. And like, I mean, there's 187,000 people watching it right now. Like, you can't expect chat to not be full of trolling. And they have no slowdown on the chat, Jim. The slowdown is like five seconds. So every five seconds you can post a message. Even if they put the slowdown to fucking half an hour, that's still 180,000 people, so you get one pulse per second no matter what. And uh, by the time it comes around to the next one. 
or that by the time the 30 minutes is up for the first person who chatted, it just keeps going on and on and on. You could actually have a circular throw. Saying hello to the yeah. barrier. Mm. There's loads of people um, posting ASCII dick buck. You know, it was getting like purged nearly straight away, but he kept coming up like in like a continuous stream. Mm. Stream, you say? On Twitch? No. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. That's your terrible joke retribution right there. <laughs> Did you see uh, a on it? This guy is a different than usual height. <laughs> <laughs> Well noticed, Twitch chat, you fucking cancerous piece of shit. Did you, um, see carcinogens run, Nigel? I watched a bit of it, but he seemed kind of annoying. Holy shit, I've just, after I've just called Twitch chat cancer, there's a guy called carcinogen, that is terrific. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty funny. It's quite funny that he's on the anti-cancer, like, thing he's called carcinogen. Yeah, he's kind of, he's kind of awful, he's awful. Were know. you there near the end? No, I only seen a bit. When people just couldn't like, oh, he's such a cunt. Oh yeah, like, nobody likes fuck him. Fuck carcinogen, you're a yeah. wanker. It went like mad. And the chat went like, yeah, nobody likes him. Even other streamers don't like him. Because he was really cocky at the end. He was like, oh, um, I have the world record because um, I'm just naturally the best at the game. But the, the amount of eye rolling that goes on when you watch him. Yeah. I'm like, black guy kind of looks like William, but black. Black Willing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ten out of ten. <laughs> Not a single. Black Willing was on the internet. I just love that though. That it was instant. That Nara fucking said that. Not a moment to think about it. Yeah. <laughs> I don't need a moment to think about Black Willing. <laughs> That's, that's your trick. I'm always thinking of about, about like, <laughs> <laughs> That's my incredible like super power, yeah. I don't want anybody notice me. Nobody notices my messages here. It's because you're one in a, like a hundred thousand, aren't you, know, Nigel? One hundred eighty thousand. One hundred seventy thousand. No one will get their attention. Spam just loads of symbols. That'll make sure everyone sees it. Yeah, I totally see that working out. I, I push G followed by a load of Kappa Pride. No homo, yeah? <laughs> Did you see the t-shirt I sent you, Nigel? For you uh, and William? No. Did you look at it, the no homo shirt? Uh, yes. You should have got that for you and William. I No William's been dead. Have you spoke to him since? No. Have you messaged him back? He hasn't been online on Facebook in like three months. Everyone's also polite, uh, polite here on EU1. Everyone beeps and everyone beeps back. Right. Carry on with your stupid conversation. <laughs> it better be cool to keep an out of it. Fucking nerds. They're obviously going to be nerds, Nigel. No, they there's hardly going to be a fucking fella coming oh, in, po popping him. Oh, shut up. The whole, the whole chat is filled up with the word cool. What the hell? How random. Oh, it's so random. <laughs> Amazing. Now, wow. How wacky. Like, have you become a basic white bitch? <laughs> 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 oh. Like, what is it? That. You've got that bit of a vibe about you. <laughs> they, banned, they banned me from the chat for saying I'm gay. Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> Homophobic wankers. Yeah. What the hell? <laughs> I said I'm gay, Kappa Bride, and then I got banned. <laughs> We're gonna gay. Homophobia. We're gonna gay things. You know what I remembered uh, yesterday and told Nigel about Niall? That time we were watching that TV show in Rathbron, and it was a guy who had a forked penis. <laughs> oh, oh, gee, that was horrible, Jane. Yeah. Why, why would you want to put yourself through watching that? Uh, I didn't. No, I just brought it up because I knew it would make Nigel uncomfortable. 
Has it worked yeah, why, again? Why were you even watching that show to begin with? You were watching it too, it was on like Channel 4 or something and we just randomly saw it. Yeah, but you were looking out to watch it, James. I was like, fuck, it was on after <coughs> the Big Bang Theory, when we could still get the TV from the aerial and not serve you. I thought it was, I thought it was, I thought it was after Spider-Man. Oh, no, no. Well, no. No, I downloaded Spider-Man. Wait, was it not, not the, that Spider-Man, the other one, the older one with Tony Maguire? I mm -hmm. don't remember seeing that. You know the one where he gets a black suit and he becomes a, an asshole. Yeah. That's, that's, that helped me learn that black people when you go black, you turn on <laughs> He suddenly became the cool, like, I'm cool dude. Well, he assaults Mary Jane. Yes, yeah. and, and here. Yeah. When you go black, you beat women. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do your shit. And, and <laughs> fight in bars. That's funny, because like the chat just filled up with disrespect to black people. Uh, and I'm now hemorrhaging viewers because of what Niall is saying, even though it's hilarious. No, no, just, <laughs> just kidding. Yeah. Hashtag not racist. <laughs> Hashtag oh. not racist unless you're a Jew. Is that <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay, Jews allowed. <laughs> um, I saw this fucking video <laughs> uh, recently. It was on. Uh, forgive me. It was on Reddit. Uh, on one called uh, live stream fails, where it's just like this chat show uh, thing on Twitch. This guy he goes off on one of the other fucking hosts. Because uh, he's like entirely drunk and he's just gone. I'm like a, a welfare bitch and all this fucking stuff, and it's it, it's fucking hilarious. And he does so many mic drops and it's fantastic. I'm gonna actually stop the truck and link you to that video now so you can have a laugh. Ah, uh, stopping the truck did not go as planned. <laughs> Why am I eating toast at this hour of the morning? <laughs> All toast is toast toast. Yeah, this is a pretty good one because you get videos of people fucking throwing up on, on themselves in this and fucking <laughs> Ain't awesome game stun quick runner leaves steam notifications on during run watch that another time uh, here we go <laughs> Holy shit! My wire got up around the toaster. Still. This is amazing. Mm. All right, we'll set it up. Please. Five billion top prize. Roll it up. Know that. Well, let's do some shots. This is the New Year's show. Let's get drunk and uh, then we can give away shit. Let's have it. Just mm. type, type you know away in the channel Here's for a second. We'll take shots. Going down in Belgium, other than them covering, like you know, and saying, "Hey, don't meet up in fucking places publicly." Huh? Just off the music. Uh, just ignore the music, it's just like an intro thing. <laughs> but, but, but watch what he starts saying to the fucking guy on the top uh, left. It's the guy on the top right who says stuff to him. Pick a box between 1 and 10, not 5, not 6, not 10. Like, this is literally kid. the worst game ever. If a fucking Eve dev ever came up with this shit, they'd be Hold like, on. fuck you. But oh, wait, you the problem is Zach's like, I'll take the billion! I'll take the billion! Because <laughs> I have I support uh, Reddit nope. saying that this is the worst game related to it's Eve. Scooter! Scooter! And anybody Car can kill them Carker fucking thinks selves I'm drunk. being part of it. Well, there you go. Are you drunk? Oh, this music is intolerable. Yeah, just, just wait. 
waited well, out. I skipped ahead a bit. That's at 130-ish. Let's, let's go with the 4 billion. Let's go with this that 4 billion. This is literally the worst fucking game ever. I this is not. Nah, dude, this is good. Minutes ago. Because okay. here we go. Everybody out there hates you and they think that you are a scum-sucking fucking welcome person. You're wanting to play this game right now. Fuck now, dude. Watch your... 145. You're on fucking welfare, so stop that shit. You're on Wayfair, whatever you want to call it. Okay? Yeah, so are you, so shut the fuck up. Stop, stop. Now, moving on. I swear to God, this now, um, we're doing good. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> it gets worse as it goes on. <laughs> right. So, I'll get back to my driving and leave you to enjoy the miracle that is that video. <laughs> Your man's wife is in like to shut the fuck up mode. <laughs> She's such a spoiled sport, she mutes the mic a couple of times while he's saying the really juicy stuff, I think. So we will never know what kind of tirade he went on. The woman called Chocolate Rain has the worst name, she sounds like the worst stripper ever. So friendly on EU1, that's. I don't think I've passed a single person who didn't beep. Maybe they're trying to tell me, like, my trailer's on fire or something like that. <laughs> I like the dude with the beard, how he can't cope with anything, he's just like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Just fucking shuts down. Because <laughs> he's directing all his fucking fury at him for whatever reason, I don't know. <laughs> Annoy these fuckers in chat. Going Eve is serious business. I think I am I don't have to bed, look. Hi, John. Hmm? What? Alright, night, you're going to bed. Yeah, yep. User disconnected from your channel. Never got to say goodbye. Balls itch. Ah. Well, I was turnoing, you wrecked into me. I took a wide turn there for I had my signal out. Uh, where did that go? <laughs> for I had my single uh, signal on, so it was your fault. Ah, this isn't as funny as I thought it would be. Two people bitching about who's wrong in a car crash. A bullering cock tacker is his best insult. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I like the Twitch, the Twitch comments, best show on earth. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> Fucking speeding cameras everywhere in this cunt of a country.
the woman's like the embarrassment on that woman's face is also quite priceless. Wife. No, the one in the bottom left. Ah. Uh. <laughs> also, peace out, nigga. He comes back though, I think, if you're at the part that I'm thinking of. Oh, I just got out after he said peace out, nigga. Because <laughs> uh. <laughs> that's the perfect ending to it. Peace out, nigga. Check how many minutes are left, because if, if it's not over, then he does come back and he gets even fucking worse. <laughs> no, it was like ah. 30 seconds or something. <gasps> He'd already come back like twice. It says Browns Gaming and Rashers and Beans are still here. Huh. Refresh your... Not their views aren't coming up. Refresh your... Uh, age, because it might not be... Uh... Dating. Oh yeah, they've gone now. Seems the, the unfriendliest drivers are in Rotterdam, I wonder why. Yeah, yeah it's strange that. Yeah. There seems to be massive problems with that multiplayer lately. Doesn't there? Not really. For you, yeah, but not for me. I thought it was quite enough in Rotterdam this time. So. No, there's a million people now. No, because a, a lot of them are actually on uh, the South American server for once. There's like 400 people on that. That's usually empty. It is midday for them though now. Yeah. It's still with the rednecks that are too drunk to be able to actually get behind their vehicle, get behind one virtually. What the fuck? There's some guy reversing all the way down the fucking mo- there's two of them! <laughs> what. The. Fuck. Uh. As you do. There's another one. <laughs> yeah. That, that sentence is the most incoherent English I've read in a while. I'm here, I'll meet her for cars. Right, I've entered into the fucking lion's den of bad driving, so here goes nothing. One of those reversing pricks is trying to reverse into me. You're not a safe zone when you're the town. Oh. But it was collision free. Oh, only the actual areas that you have to drop shit off in. I remember when the whole town used to be collision free. Jesus James, you run so low on fuel, like 80% of the time. I think I might have realistic consumption turned on. Do you have many um, points in the eco-driving? 
Um, that doesn't help either, does it? On back gear speed, I have speed 60 kilometers an hour. He's a fucking cheater. How can you go backwards at 60? I don't know. What? Fucking thing stalled again, piece of shit. Doing now. Accidentally hit my mic on my head. That's about right. Be right back in a second. You're not missing much.
I'm back. I'm getting the fuck out of Dodge. Why? What's happening? It's fucking madhouse of a city. It's happening. Does the fast travelling between the cities work? Does it still? It does, but I'm reluctant to do it because I'm already low on fuel and I don't know how that'll affect that. Break down halfway. Oh, and my luck. Break down in the fucking Europort or somewhere like that where there's a bunch of people. <laughs> and they will get mad at you. Mercedes-Benz truck dealer, all the way here in Rotterdam, you can guarantee that I'm never going to come this way to buy a Mercedes, no sir. I bought my, I can't even remember where I bought mine. Power! Unlimited power! <laughs> Actually, it's limited to 60k. Balls. <laughs> Why, what are you buying? Oh, it's... <laughs> I meant power in terms of acceleration, but uh, uh, acceleration is capped. What? In, being uh, <laughs> being in 11th, the yeah, being 11th in preparation of the Europort, where I'm gonna do some sick fucking barrel rolls. Hmm. Take out a whole row of people. <laughs> yep, that is the plan. One begins now. Just for shits and giggles, do you want me to do a barrel roll on this thing? Because <laughs> there's a 90 degree corner coming up ahead that I could take. Oh that I could take at 110 kilometers an hour. Strictly not good. But yes. Strictly for your amusement, of course, right? I'm gonna do a quick save here then. I'm gonna do an epic stunt. Uh oh, there are people. Fuck it. No stunts from me. Where's my roll, goddammit, James? The fuck is this guy beeping at? Probably you. It, no, he's just alone, and he's fucking beeping away to himself. <laughs> Many men do that on a cold winter's night. Sit by the firelight. Beep away. Whoa. Herb there. Will they just kick you from the server if you keep passing into shit? And collision zone! Maximum speed! <laughs> It'd be funny if it was a collision zone now. <laughs> He's just ploughed straight into the back. Uh, Harwich, because oh. I need to get to a petrol station then soon. Doesn't make any sense for it to be five euros more expensive for double the distance. Driving on the proper side of the road this time around, and I almost forgot that fact. <laughs> I accidentally go down the wrong side quite a lot. You're gonna get speed camera, James. Not going exactly at the limit. Cruise control. Hey, here's. Cruise control. Huh? 
So I've always wanted to use cruise control to see what it's like. A real car? Yeah. yeah. Like, yeah, cruise control on a real car, just see what it's like. I bet you it doesn't hold steady. On a full speed journey to try and find a petrol station. It can only end well. <laughs> Maybe we get fined or break down. Is that why you're going 110 in an 80 zone? Yep. Ah, uh, I don't know which way to go. Fuck, they're equally far each side. But I suppose I'll go to the... Uh, right. Have you not got a package for delivery, no? Oh. Do you know I've picked one up? Four, just in case. <laughs> no, because I... First prior... Oh, fucking hell, the fourth feedback is struck. Strong, <laughs> as I say, as I'm on two wheels <laughs> near about to fucking over. Uh, no, I didn't get a package because I knew I had to go and get fuel. And I have no idea, or I had no idea, where the nearest petrol station in. Uh, um, Rotterdam was. And fuck it, I'll just go over to the UK. That cost you money, James. <gasps> you've got to be, you've got to be fucking kidding me. It's on the other side of the road. Mm -hmm. Oh, you didn't check that, did you? Couldn't. I had like a fucking less than ten seconds to make the decision based on highly zoomed out uh, GPS. <laughs> you, you fucked, James. You could say that, yeah. <laughs> What's the cost of recovery? Fuck if I know. Wait, no, there's a petrol station on my side just up ahead. You're lucky, James. I'm always lucky. That's 50 XP for 100 kilometers of road. What's that about, James? Because I got 50 XP for doing 100 kilometers of roaming. I'm silly. I haven't discovered anything in Scandinavia. Fuck it, I'm gonna see what happens when I take this turn really hard. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you'll see that shit soon enough. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, Jesus. Oh, well. That is why I... Oh, I can't... That's why I saved before I did that. <laughs> <laughs> Always worth doing. James, drive better, goddammit. No, no, no. Have to drive another day. Ha. Do you know what it might be? I changed the chassis on this thing recently. I wonder did it make my fuel tank smaller? It looks like it did. That would explain why I have to get more fuel all the fucking time. Can you not just in get an improved fuel tank? Don't think so. Cause that's logical. They do that in real life.
I need IRL straps in a video game, James. I wouldn't know about such things, especially when it pertains to driving. I think I'll leave this for the night once I've parked up. Okay, that's me done. I'm mm, just gonna quick save it first though. There we go. User disconnected from your channel.